In this video, I'm going to show you one of the most underrated user rushes against the Trips tight end offense in Madden 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is all about helping people become the best Madden players that they can possibly become. And so if you are looking to get better at this game, I want to encourage you to to click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It is completely free to subscribe and it just allows you to be able to stay up to date with all the latest tips and strategies coming out here right on the channel. Now in today's video, I am breaking down my nickel 335 wide defense. This is my favorite defense in the entire game. And I'm gonna be sharing with you a user rush that you can do um, against trips tight end. Now to use this, what you wanna do is you wanna put your flats on 25, your curl flats on five or 10 yards, your hooks on five yards, and then everything else is kind of the standard stuff. But that's kind of how you wanna start out. Now again, if you want to get my full nickel 335 wide defensive guide that shows you how to run literally the best defense in Madden 21, I'm going to leave a link to in, the, in the description for you to be able to pick that up. It is just 15 bucks for the entire defense. I literally walk you through not only how to run the defense, but how to run the defense against a lot of the best offenses in Madden 21. So if you want to learn a hands-on guide to the nickel 335 wide defense, there's going to be a link in the description that will walk you through that. Now the play that we're going to be going over in today's video is the Mike Blitz 3. As you can see, this is kind of what the play looks like uh, pre-snap. Now all we're going to do as far as setting this up is we are going to shift our D-line to the right. We're going to crash our D-line out. We're going to grab our user and we're going to kind of bring him right here in this little spot right here, just like so. And then all we're going to do with our, with our middle linebacker right here is we are actually going to go ahead and we are going to put him into a hard flat type of zone. So you see I just audibled him right over here into a hard flat type of zone. I've got three deep coverage here and on the back side what I can do is I could put this guy into a little vertical hook or I could bluff blitz him. If I bluff blitz him you see that he's going to check into a three rec hook zone which is even better. He's going to play a lot of stuff over the middle of the field for me. And then all I'm going to do is they're going to kind of assume that you're using Savage. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on over here to Alexander and as long as they don't motion anybody over to the right, I'm just going to kind of preset my guy to run downhill. And at the snap of the ball, I'm just going to run literally right off the edge and sack the quarterback. As you can see, it is literally instant pressure. It is about as fast as you could possibly imagine a pressure getting. And the cool part about this defense is you can actually mess around a little bit and take more people off. So, for example, if you wanted to do something like this right here, where you have a Mabel coverage. As you can see, I have a Mabel coverage on the left side with a three red hook zone. And then what I can do is still click onto this guy right here. And as long as I kind of get in quick, they're not gonna be anticipating. And as you can see, I'm getting instant pressure, sending only four people at the quarterback. Instant pressure as a user rush, sending only four people at the quarterback. Again, all our setup is, is we audible to Mike Blitz three, we're gonna shift our defensive line to the right. We're gonna bring our user over and we're gonna put him into a flat zone. Um, and then what we're gonna do on the left side is we can do whatever we want with these two guys. So we could drop them into a flat and a three rack, which is what I will oftentimes do. We could also do a vertical hook um, and a hard flat. I personally just like to simply do a hard flat and either a three rack or a vertical hook, just like this right here. And then I'm gonna pass commit and I'm gonna click on Alexander. Now he's practically, this is what the defense looks like. As you can see, it's a four man edge pressure off the right, but you have a Mabel coverage on the right side. So you're gonna have good coverage. If they try to throw quick to the back or anything like that, they're gonna throw right into, their, into your user, which is very, very unlikely. And as you can see, I mean, right, literally we just got two people free at the quarterback with one simple tactic. Now, one thing I wanna be very upfront and clear about is if for whatever reason, they motion somebody. So let's say that you set this up like this, Right, this is a very popular tactic from trips tight end. They'll do, you'll set your defense up just like so, and then what's gonna happen is they're going to motion this guy. If they motion this guy, you're just gonna click onto the safety right here, snap the ball, come off the edge. That's all you gotta do. You're just gonna click onto the safety while they motion, come off the edge just like that, or you can blitz the safety and drop into coverage if you wanted to do something like that. That is the easiest strategy that I know as far as how to handle this. Another little tip for this, if you wanted to make it a little bit easier as far as your audibly and things like that, all you have to do is just simply shade your coverage down, just like so. Put your linebacker on a little, um, put your linebacker on a little curl flat, and then you can do the same thing on this side right here. And then if they motion somebody, let's say they mo, like let's for example, let's say that they motion 
um, this guy, then we're just going to hot route ourselves to a, uh, a little cloud flat. We're going to bring this guy down just like so, and we're just running right off the edge. As you can see, instant pressure at the quarterback, and it's so, so smooth against trips tight end. It's, in my opinion, the best user rush against trips tight end that you could possibly have because it doesn't it doesn't appear to be like you're sending. I mean, you're not sending. You're only sending like four people. And if we took it even a step further, I guarantee you, like if we did something like this, um, if I went ahead and took this guy over here, put him in a flat zone, and then what I did over here is I did something like this, vert hook in a flat, and then I took this guy and bluff blitzed him just like so. Now I'm only blitzing three people. I'm literally blitzing three people at the quarterback. Um, and what you're going to see here, we're going to run right around again. So that's the beauty of this. You can drop so many people in coverage. And, I mean, shoot, let's try to do it with just two people. You can drop a lot of people in coverage on this and still get a very, very good pressure. So let's say, for example, we'll do something like this, maybe even add another yellow zone to our to our field, or what we could do is something like maybe a little cover two action, something like this right here. We got a deep half over there to protect anything deep, and you're gonna see one man pressure, or literally, you know, not even two man pressure at the quarterback, instant sack with that user rush. This right here is one of the reasons why the nickel 335 wide is the best defense in the entire game. And if you want to learn how to run the best defense in Madden 21, I want to encourage you to get my nickel 335 wide defensive guide. I'm going to be putting a link to that defense in the description of this video. And I'm just telling you from a personal experience, you will not regret running this defense. You will be amazed at how consistent this defense is for you and how effective you'll become literally overnight with this defensive system. So if you want to get the full ebook, it is available in the description of this video.